Hey guys, hope everyone's day is going well, and in today's video I'm going to be teaching you my newest yo-yo trick. So this is a trick that I've been working on for a little while. It's not that long, but I think it's a really nice element that will click really well, especially for competition. That was the goal. So just one more thing before I start the tutorial. I'll be using the C3 Yo-Yo Design Vapor promotion for this entire tutorial. So without further ado, let's get into the tutorial. Alright, hey guys, so let's first look at what the trick looks like from my perspective. So, here we go. Alright, sweet. So, let's start the trick. So, we start with the trapeze. What we're going to do here is you're going to turn your hand inward like that, and just grab just this entire thing with your throw hand. So, you're in like this, we just grab it, pull it like that. What we're going to do here is just move this part and have the yo-yo go on top of the string. So coming from the front, just like that. And now let go with this thumb. So you should only be having like your entire throw hand in and your entire non-throw hand in. It's kind of like this kamikaze mount. Okay, so we're here. We turned in. We grabbed it. We put it like this. All right. So we are here. We're going to pinch right here on the, the string that's coming off, going over your throw hand like this. You're going to pinch and you're going to do a similar motion to the trapeze and his brother slack, which looks like this. Okay, so again, we're here. We've just gotten into this mount. Pinch, and what you're going to do is this string right here is going to come around and you're going to undercut it. So it's going to come around like this, and you want to intercept that with your finger. So this, this is kind of hard to explain, but I'm just going to slow this one down for you guys. Just try to look at it, figure it out, because it's really hard to explain. So your pinch comes around, and you separate the two strings. Okay? One more time. And so one tip for this part, since it is pretty difficult, is keep your hands pretty close together when you're doing this. Because basically, the slack is going to come around, and you're going to want to pull your hands apart like that. Okay? So... You're here, you pinch, keep them together, and pull apart like that. Okay, hopefully you got that. So, you should be here. What you're going to do now is swing over like this, and you should look like this. Alright, what you're going to do here is put your finger right like this, and swing onto this middle string that's coming right down like that. So, we are here, we have just gone like that, put your finger right here and roll right onto that string, like that. Alright, so now you're in this kind of mount, so it's actually not that, like, uh, crazy, it's just the slack is right there. So, what you're going to do is you're going to hit this string and roll over uh, this hand, like here, like that. Alright, basically, you're here, just going to roll, hit that string, roll it right over. Now, you're going to keep your fingers together like this. You're basically just in an upside down green triangle. But what you're going to do is once you're here, you're going to roll and swing over both your fingers so it looks like this. So we're here. We've just swung the entire yo-yo over. We're in this mount, okay? Here's where it gets a little bit tricky. What you're going to do is kind of take these... you got these two strings right here. This one and this one. This one's coming around from your uh, throw hand knot, and these two are just on your pointer fingers. What we're gonna do is you're gonna take these strings and go over the yo-yo like that. So I'm gonna go over that part just a little bit more because it can be pretty tricky. All right, so you're here. You swung around like this. Now you're gonna take these two strings and sh put them over top the yo-yo, underneath and to the back. All right. So now that we are here, we're going to swing on just like we're in the kamikaze mount, but this is kind of a strange kamikaze mount with a twist. So we're gonna swing over our like throw hand just like this and you're going to land on this string so just like that so it's kind of going to be this dense mount and as you can see it's really slowing down my yo-yo but from here it's actually not too bad so 
over here. We just slack, hit that string, roll over, bring these two strings like so, over like that, swing onto here, now you're going to swing over, now you just want to swing onto this string, just undercut it like that, all right? So we're here, what we're going to do is let go with your uh, pointer finger of your throw hand, like that, swing over once, now you have this kink right here, this kind of twist, so you're going to swing over both of your fingers like this. You're not rolling over like that. The string doesn't roll over. You're rolling over in front of both of your hands. So just like that. So now you should be in a trapeze. So if you want, you can start stop there. It's still a really nice element that gets you a lot of clicks. However, if you want to go and add like a little extra element, I'll show you how to do that now. Okay, so just for the sake of time, I'm going to start in a trapeze once we've done that trick. So you should be here. What you're going to do is you just swing towards your throw hand. Just swing right off into a trapeze in his brother, like that, just like that. And one thing that's going to help with this next part is I suggest you curl these three fingers in like so. You're just going to swing it off the front like, like that. All right, so this next element is actually not mine. Yotrix does a great tutorial on it. So if you want like further clarification for this next element that I'm about to do, I'm going to have a link to the tutorial down below. But essentially, here's the, what the element looks like. It looks like that. Okay, so I'm going to explain it just kind of on the basic side. If you want a more in-depth tutorial, again, the link is in the description if you want to learn this part of the trick. So, we're here. Swing right there. Pinch. So here's how you do this element. Pretty basic. What you're going to do is you're going to pinch, swing over like you would in a trapeze in his brother slack, but you're going to undercut it like so. Alright, so you're on these double strings. You are almost done with the trick. Here's where it gets a little bit challenging, but this is just something you're going to practice. So, there are two strings right here. If you let go right here, you're just, you're in no mount, okay? So, we're here. What you're going to do is you're going to go around the yo-yo, like so. You're going to let go with this pointer finger right here. The slack's going to come around, so the slack should right now be on your hand, like so. You're going to take your finger and just do like an under whip like that, okay? Bring it around like this. So you're going to swing this into the back of the yo-yo. This is all going to be done in one motion, so it's kind of confusing, but hopefully you guys can get this part. So you're here, you're just going like this. You're going to like hop the yo-yo into the air while letting go with your pointer finger right here and kind of turn your hand over and slack it in. From here, you're going to swing the slack around and loop it in like that, okay? So that's what this looks like. From here, you're just going to drop your pointer finger on your throw hand, just like this. Swing the O around and bind it however you would like. And yeah, that is the complete trick that I'll be teaching you guys today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And right now, we're going to go through it once more, just a really basic run through. All right, here we go. Trapeze. Grab the string, pull it under, slack it over, like so. Onto this string, roll over your entire hand, bring these two to the front, right there onto this string, drop it, swing around twice in a trapeze. Swing off like that, get into this mount that Yotrix teaches, come around, loop into this uh, like kind of kamikaze-like mount, drop it, and bind. But overall, that's the trick. I think this trick will click really well. It's got a lot of different string hits that there are in there, and it's some pretty nice text. So, hope you guys enjoy the tutorial, and yeah, that's about it. Okay, so thank you guys all so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy this tutorial, definitely leave a like, and also, if you're new here, I post videos usually on the weekends, and if you're enjoying the content, it'd be awesome if you subscribed, if not already. That is about it for today's weekly video. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.